Sometimes all it takes to turn a life around is a lucky find. Here's Steve Hartman. Many homeless people are haunted by drug addiction, mental illness, or a criminal past. Indeed, Elmer Alvarez knows all those demons. But he says just because a person is without a home doesn't mean they're void of character. For example, the day he found a check. I will never forget that day, right over here. For $10,000. Right over here. Had you seen that many zeros in your life? No, well, not <laughs> really. <laughs> the first thing that came through my mind was, I gotta look for this person. First thing you're thinking wasn't like, I can go cash this check and change my life? It never crossed my mind, because I made a decision to turn my life over. I've been clean for three years. Congratulations. Thank you. I didn't even know I dropped this check. The money belonged to New Haven, Connecticut real estate broker, Roberta Hosky. Where's he at? She recorded her meeting with the Good Samaritan. And I expected to find a guy all nice, cleanly shaved in a blue suit like you. That's not what you got? Uh-uh. <laughs> Instead, she got Elmer, who cried when Roberta offered him a reward. And it shattered the stereotypes. This all happened about a year ago, but the best part of the story is what has happened since. She helped him find an apartment, paid his rent for seven months till he was back on his feet. She also put him through real estate school, and together they're now working on a little real estate project. Won't make him a dime, but it could be very rewarding. No, he identified the property. In the next year, they plan to build a transitional house for homeless teenagers and young adults. The house will provide all kinds of services that Elmer says are crucial. I know what it is to be homeless. Nobody deserves to live like that. No. Roberta could not agree more. Because I remember. I remember what it felt like to be in that shelter. That's right. Before she built her multi-million dollar company, Roberta was also homeless. A teenage mom who worked her way out of poverty and is now offering Elmer a chance to make his dream come true as well. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Eventually, he'll serve as an advisor at the transitional house. You could end up helping a lot of kids. Yes, that's what I want to do. A lost check. It's amazing. Leads to a found purpose. <laughs> we need that. I know that's right. We need it.